The following is a public service announcement. Well, Mother's Day is Sunday. Father's Day is in June. Facts. It's been a hard ass time for families. Feel like the animals in the zoo. Trapped. Parents need some help these days. Kids could use some too. Help. So given the special circumstance, we'd like to introduce a special rule. Let kids drink. Just like mom and dad. If they got a little buzz on, would it really be that bad? Let kids drink. Tiny drinks. Just a couple sips. Full drinks. They'll be happier and funnier, and they'll fall asleep by six. They used to give kids whiskey to help them fall asleep. That's history. So a teeny tiny white claw is just a babysitter on the cheese. Economics. They let kids in France drink wine, a bottle or two a day. Mm. We asked child services, and they said it was OK. Let kids drink. Not like they can drive. Except that one kid on the news who drove when he was five. Just one drink. One drink. Two if they've been good. Oh, uh, uh, uh huh. Babies look drunk anyway. They burp and puke just like I would. Kids are quite resilient and they always bounce right back. Bouncy kids. And it's not like they'll get blackout. Drinking half of a six pack. Wait, what? They watched us drink a hundred drinks and smoke a little weed. That is medicine. So turn that Shirley Temple into an Ina Garden Grand Martini. And now here's a bedtime story. It's vodka soda line. God, let me drink. I hate that I have to ask. You can have milk. All I want is a drink and a shot and a little pills and crack. Let dogs drink. The smarter, nicer kids. Once a day, let's fill their bowl with a cold, refreshing spray. And let guys drink. Guys can drink alone. Drink alone inside the shed and say we're on the phone. Beck, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just. I'm on the phone. Someone get that guy a drink. Totally. He gets it. Let kids drink. Let Half of all us parents, I say kids, cheers to you.